The Whistling Lamb Wooly is walking through the field. Suddenly, she hears something. It sounds like music. But where is it coming from? Wooly looks around her, and then she sees. It's Nightingale. Hello, Wooly calls out. You whistle so well. Thank you, Nightingale shouts. I am the best whistler of all the animals. Wow, Wooly says. I want to whistle as good as you do. Then come with me. I will teach you how to whistle, says Nightingale. And Wooly goes with Nightingale. Nightingale shows her how to whistle. That's how it's done. Now you try it, Wooly. Wooly tries. And tries again. But no matter how hard she tries, she can't do it. Do you know what I think, Nightingale says? I think that sheep are unable to whistle. Maybe Owl has a solution. Owl thinks and thinks. Hmm, yes, 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 I do have an idea. Woodpecker, can you make a nice flute for Wooly? Sure, Woodpecker says. I should be able to. I will do my best. Here you are. A flute for Wooly. Oh, that's a nice flute. I'm going to practice right away, Wooly says. After a while, Wooly is able to whistle a tune. Secretly, Nightingale is listening. He is not happy that Wooly whistles so well. The night has fallen, and Wooly is sleeping. But who's there? It's Nightingale. Ah, there's the flute. Carefully, Nightingale moves closer. He takes the flute. Nightingale is sure he will be able to play the flute as well as Wooly did. He blows into one of the holes. But nothing happens. But then... Oh no! Nightingale's beak is stuck in the flute! Startled, Nightingale flies to Owl. But Nightingale, Owl says, how did you get your beak stuck in the flute? Can you please help me? Nightingale asks. Hmm. Yes. Yes, well, I have an idea. Woodpecker, can you free Nightingale? Let me see, Woodpecker says. Hmm. No, no. Maybe this will free Nightingale. And while Wooly is still asleep, Nightingale is set free. <coughs> the next morning, Wooly wakes up. And then... Where's my flute? Sadly, she looks for her flute. Where can my flute be? Where could my flute have gone? Wooly! Wooly! 
Here's your flute, Nightingale shouts down from the sky. But Nightingale, why do you have my flute? Oh, Wooly, I'm so sorry. I was afraid that you had become the best whistler of all the animals. I wanted to whistle as good as you. So I stole your flute and, and, uh, oh, crazy Nightingale, how could you ever think that? We both whistle in a very different way. But I have a good idea. Let's make some music together. And so they do. That night, they sit on the top of the hill where everyone can hear them. And together, they give a beautiful concert. <laughs> <laughs> 